Hey guys, this is Noctium, and this is uh, the second part of Let's Quickly Play Fallout. I know it's been 16 years since the last one, and I didn't really show you much uh, in the last one. Uh, but in this, as I said, as I promised, but, uh, better late than never, um, that I'll be showing you all uh, the secrets and things you may have missed when first playing Fallout. And those who've just started playing Fallout, here's a nice guide to give you a bit of a leg up if you're having a hard time. And the first thing we're going to look for is Chance's Knife, which is a great melee, we melee weapon, which uh, if you pick a melee character and you build it that way, uh, it can be an effective weapon right up until the end of the game. But what you didn't know is that you can very easily get it from the word go when you start playing. And I'll show you. So what you have to do is come out of uh, Dr. Mi Dr. Mitchell's house here uh, and Usually, you start the game with just like a 9mm pistol. I'd say you have really no choice in Good Springs besides if, siding with the Powder Gangers uh, if you then just sort of. Uh, what's the word? Yeah, just picking the good option, thinking Good Springs is fantastic, nice wee village full of nice people, and if you try and loot the place, you'll be shot to pieces because you're not a, an effective character until much later in the game. Um, so I'll just demonstrate that for you. Uh, if you go into Good Spring Saloon, if you pick Good Spring Saloons as your first target, uh, let's say if you target what's his face first. For Pete's sake. Back. That's me killing an old man. I go in here. Try and kill um Come on. As you can see from the vats, we don't seem to take a lot off Sonic. So, uh... Okay, my point still stands. If you try and go and ransack Good Springs with uh, just your normal weapons, uh, Come on. you're not going to get very far. But I'll show you how to find Chance's knife, which could possibly change all that. So just go. So you come out here. There's Victor, and you go up here. You go towards your grave. I'll tell you one thing. I was expecting to be murdered. Uh, with just the normal weapons, but I did better than I thought I would, but I still maintain I was shot down and killed. Which I was. Um, so here, okay, you come up to the keep out sign up here. Let's see if I can remember this. Where's it the first? Right, yeah. So you come at this, the keep out sign here. It's here, uh, and there is the garage and Dr. Mitchell's house is going to come down this road and up here, and when you hit that, you go left up here. So go up here. Is 
a coyote. Normally you do not see the coyote up here, but which just makes me think I'm doing this wrong. There's the water tower in the grave, uh, which must be meaningless, but uh, there it is. Ah, and there we go. And here's Chance's grave right there. So you miss all the Cazadors down there, there should be, usually be Cazadors down there which uh, are hard if you're a high level character, let alone just coming out of Dr. Mitchell's house. And uh, if you scale up there, go left at the sign, up the hill, keep going this way, eventually you come down to this small big ravine, and just below it, at the crypt here, is Chance's Grave. So we'll drop on it. As you saw, I forgot my shovel, and you can get that at uh, the general store from Shet, and it costs 13 caps, I think, depends on your barter. And otherwise, you need that to open Shan's grave, and as you noticed, I am level 1, just starting the game with only 50 XP. Uh, I don't know if you get that immediately, and here I am with Chance's grave, and I'm going to get Chance's knife, there we go. It's damage 18, DPS 82, uh, and that's a very powerful game, a powerful le a weapon to get at the beginning. Sorry if I sound all funny, it's quite late. Okay, now that I've got that, we just fast travel to Good Springs. Now, to get the shovel, uh, you go here, Good Spring General Store, so come out of Dr. Mitchell's house, come down there, get General Store, and there should be a shovel. And then do what I showed you. In the meantime, uh, we're going to try and prove my odious point. Hey Kill shit, you can get all this stuff. There's value 20, and there's a few, few uh, fission reactors here, or fission cells, which are about like a hundred. Uh, you can sell that, and then you can make quite a lot of caps in early game. Um, in there. Should be here. Well, there's already quite a few magazines here which you can help, but I'm pretty sure there's a fishing cell here.
Easy peats. Cheyenne, stay. Until next time. And as you can see, I murdered the population of the Good Spring Saloons fairly easy with the chances now. Uh, demonstrating to you what a good find it is, especially for a level one character. Some entertainment. I'm done being nice. Yeah. If you don't hand Ringo over soon, I'm going to get my friends, and we're burning this town to the ground. Got it? Oh, well, let me do that first. Keep that in mind. Now, if you're not going to buy something, get out. Alright guys, that's me showing you how to get Chance's Knife and how you can loot all this once you've disposed of all the things. That's 20, 10, cash register as well, bottle cap 24, pre-war money, uh, everything really. And you... Alright, take care.